welcome back, after watching this special episode, so, now special episode, The Predator Part 1 and 2, 1. The special episode about the Predator specifically helps the audience get to know the background from Jung Barim's side. 2. As expected, Barim killed Pastor Komo 1, Bong Yi's grandmother in Mixed Chi Kut Dying. This is explained in detail and technicalities in the drama. 3. Sung Yohan is really after Barim so that Barim doesn't kill other victims. Unfortunately Yohan got shot by Mochi. To put it bluntly, the battle between Barim and Yohan is like a battle between two geniuses. Unfortunately fate is not on Yohan's side. 4. Apparently Barim thought of Mochi as a balanced opponent, so that he continued to challenge Mochi as a psychopath. This is commonplace, because generally predatory psychopaths are usually happy when there are police who pay attention to all their actions. The average movie or drama is about psychopaths, like this. The police force was constantly challenged by his psychopath. 5. At the end of part 2, Barim looks regretful and wants to kill himself. In fact, he wrote a will to rehabilitate Johan's name. That Johan is innocent. But at the end of episode 15, Barim receives a call from Chikuk who wants to meet. And when he met, Chikuk said that he remembered that Barim tried to kill him. And Chikuk then met his end. Presumably Barim returned to a psychopath. 6. It is still a mystery why Barim got separated from Sung ji -yoon. And instead ji -yoon took care of Johan as her son. The theory comes, ji -yoon dumped Barim after birth. Then Barim was adopted by another family. As for Johan. Maybe his mother died giving birth to him, so Ji Yoon takes care of Yohan. Even though Barium was adopted by another family, Ji Yoon still keeps a close eye on it. So when Barium was about to bury his adopted brother, suddenly Ji Yoon appeared and stopped him, saying, I should have killed you a long time ago, you are like a monster. Then Barium killed his entire adoptive family, even though there were only three bodies in the photo shown by the police. But we must remember, Rodanum likes to hide something to confuse the audience, and she got the insurance money. From that insurance money, he buys a house, as Barim told Bong Yi, when she admired his house. And a scene of Ji Yoon at the hospital vomiting after seeing Bong Yi and Barim. Then Barim scolds Ji Yoon, are you okay like strangers? Except for Ji Yoon, who does recognize Barim. So she gets nervous and leaves right away. If that's the case, then the puzzle piece is in place. All fit. However it turns out that there is a scene where Barim says my mother wants to kill me. She said I am like a monster while flashbacks of the scene of Ji Yoon choking Barim when he was about to bury his younger brother alive. This is what makes the puzzle pieces fit. Except, it turns out that Barim knows that he is an adopted child and he has already investigated who his biological mother is. Then all the puzzles are just right.